Hey guys, Jussel here, and I just wanted to make a video talking about um, how Old School RuneScape is going to be releasing permanent free-to-play on the 19th of February this month. Now, they pulled this idea along with membership bonds, and it passed with a high 85.9% approval. Now, this shows uh, that the community really wants this, and I agree with that. I really want this because I was free to play for a very, very long time until recently when I decided to become a member and uh, join the old, old school RuneScape community and start playing and uh, learning about the game because I never got to uh, explore that much uh, beyond free to play when I was younger. So they will be releasing uh, free to play on the 19th of February, like I said, um, and it's looking pretty good. They posted this on the forums. Um, on the 4th, and now they're going to be combating, uh, trying to combat bots as much as they can, uh, so they, I did expect them to have some uh, restrictions. There's a 24-hour uh, trade restriction, and you can't stake more than uh, a million GP, and I don't believe you can stake items either. Um, also, they'll be trying to limit spam bots as much as they can, uh, which is expected. Now, what I thought was interesting was that they were going to bring back U logs, so U trees and lobster fishing, because originally when they released the free to play ser trial servers, uh, they took out U trees and uh, the ability to fish lobsters for free to play to combat bots. Um, so I think that's good that they'll be adding that. Hopefully, that'll um, add some add some more variety into free to play, um, and. It also says here that they will increase the quantities of low-level monsters, and uh, I think that's a really good move on them, uh, at least for the first month or so that free-to-play is permanently released, um, because there will be an inf influx of uh, players uh, passing through Lombridge um, and Draenor and so forth, so that's a good move on them as well. Um, so there's not splashers uh, taking up all the monsters or anything, so there will be enough um, low-level monsters to start leveling up. Um, and it looks like the staff will also be doing some live streaming uh, and some events to go along with that. So make sure you guys uh, stay tuned on the social me RuneScape's social media for that. And uh, I was just wondering if, what you guys thought I should do as far as making a free-to-play account. Um, I'll probably get on my old uh, FTP uh FTP, I say FT, FTP, free to play. Um, most people say F2P though, free to play. Either way, um, getting sidetracked. But um, uh, I was wondering if you guys think I should go for a Skiller account or maybe a free to play PKing account. Both would be fun. I'll probably end up doing both. But um, as far as what you guys would like to see in video content, uh, just let me know in the comments and uh, let me know what you guys uh, think about uh, free to play coming back permanently. I'm pretty hyped about it. I'm trying to get everybody else hyped about it and, you know, spread the word, tell all your old friends, see if they can come back and play a little free to play together when it's released. Hopefully I'll see you guys on the 19th of February and I'll see you guys later. Peace.